we've all known them very well for a long time, and they're just a, an extremely nice family, a remarkable family, and their mom uh, obviously is uh, struggling to make sense of all this. A Winchester community is heartbroken and in shock as police investigate the murder of a young aspiring doctor killed while studying in the Winchester Public Library on Saturday. Family close friends Brad Harrington and Steve Smith say Deanne Kenny Stryker was someone special. Their daughters grew up with her. Deanne is a, a special kid. She's overcome, you know, some real obstacles in her life, and she decided early on that she wanted to be a doctor. Um, she studied at Northeastern University. Investigators say the 22-year-old was in the library when she was suddenly attacked and stabbed to death by 23-year-old Jeffrey Yao, also of Winchester. The young woman was in the library, seated at a table in one of the reading rooms, apparently studying or doing some work. Mr. Yao began striking her with what we now know to be a appears to be a hunting knife with approximately a 10-inch blade. Deanne was rushed to the hospital but did not survive. Police say a 77-year-old man who tried to intervene was also injured. Right now, it's still unclear why Yao attacked Deanne, but his neighbors say he has mental health issues. We know about his fits of rage. That's all we know. We thought it was under control. We never thought it was a real threat to life. All day long, folks have been leaving flowers in memory of Deanne as the family asked for privacy. Their dad passed away a number of years ago, and so the mom has raised the three girls um, mostly on her own, and everybody was just so proud of proud of her. She was just a, a remarkable kid. On Sunday, the memorial continues to grow. The library, I'm told, will remain closed at least until Tuesday as this remains under investigation. Meanwhile, Jeffrey Yao will be arraigned on Monday. He faces a number of charges. In Winchester, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.